Hello again, YouTube. We still cooking just pearly. This is the truth, man. The channel is the No Matrix, No Simp, and All Subjects channel. And I'm going to let y'all hear her, yourself, now. And then I'm going to talk about it. This is going to be a short video. But always remember when the Bible says, out of the abundance of a person's heart, the mouth speaks. So when you see people consistently in certain conversation patterns, you know that that's how they really feel. So here we go again, talking about her and this racism and the racist Nick Fuente. Let's see what she got to say. I'm just going to keep driving. Uh, listen, there's something else. Uh, uh, and I'm going to probably comment on it. Comment on it in a second. This has been pretty triggering for a lot of people. However, there's something even more triggering that I do have to ask you about because in between the time that we booked you to come on the show and you actually coming on the show, you had a guy called Nick Fuentes. Oh yeah, yeah, Nick. <laughs> yeah, uh, and then you did an interview with this guy. Like, this is not a guy we would ever have on because he's a racist, a Holocaust denying piece of shit, as far as I'm concerned. But you had him on, pretty much. And then you took that interview down and apologized. So what happened with the whole thing? Oh, there's, there's, a, I can't talk too much. There's like legal things going on. Legal. Oh, yeah, there's a not, not with Nick. Trying to, she's trying to get well, even more. But I will views. say, I, um, I did not find Nick to be racist. Uh, my staff actually. She did, did not me. find Wait, Nick to be to racist. Italian Just keep listening. Next to you and saying that she shouldn't have a black Hey, Anton, all y'all do is some suckers, he, he man. And if I ever see you, I'm going to tell you to your face. If you still taking up for so me. You just said he wasn't being racist and I watched him be racist. Y'all some suckers, no, man. I mean, it, to me, he says the same things that, like, like there's a lot of people that think like that. When but it doesn't make it less racist just because exactly. other people Exactly. Get her, man. Get that, her. But to me, it's like, his argument is more about culture. It's easier if you date someone in your culture. Um, oh, she, to, you'd have to watch the I don't like, like Pearl, man. Being a I bit don't. Like, bad up to him. I deal with these type every day in Wisconsin. I don't like them. You did say, I am a bit racist. They're troublemakers, and In fact, in your apology, you said that you said racist. Um, well, the, there's a video coming out about all of that, but you'll see. It's She's trying to get well, views, man. Pearl is, is a troll, man. Like a and everybody that's with her, those are trolls. You know they grift you. He, he is incredibly toxic. Um, he I, definitely like, I'm just is. i you my personal experience yeah. with him. Um, we filmed her personal hours experience hours with him. There is that one in like birds me, of a feather clip, flock together. Context, yeah. But I, he was really polite. He showed up on time. Like we just you know. he also and and, I, and honestly, he did a panel and he spoke about his opinions on race mixing, and a lot of people agreed with him. Okay, but that doesn't change whether it's racist or not, right? But what I'm getting. Do you to, think it's racist to like? I'm, I'm curious. Yeah. Do you think it's no. racist, like if I'm Irish and I say I she want to? She talked about she's for men's, men's right. Everybody no, know women that cut off men. You, that's Irish, disrespectful. You shouldn't date a black man. That is racist. Yeah. If you're Irish and because when he spoke about it on the show, it was more about culture. Than no, race. See, mm -hmm. so but to me, that doesn't really annoying, work. man. So I'll give you an example. I'm half Latin American. I take after the white dad's Irish side. If I date a Jamaican woman, Jamaica and Venezuela have a very similar culture. We're culturally very similar. We have the same food, the same religion, whatever else. So to me, that argument doesn't work. Do you see what I'm saying? Wait, Venezuela and what? And Jamaica. So Venezuela is at the top of South America oh, and see. Jamaica is all Trinidad, which is literally, you see it over the water. Yeah, well, it's just, when he was talking, he was talking about how he wanted to date an Italian like versus um that's like hard to listen to her too she's boring man Italian. i don't so see how anybody i don't get the fascination yeah. kevin yeah. samuels yeah. wasn't born she shouldn't be dating a black man mm -hmm. that's right the racist part don't mm -hmm. you think mm -hmm. um i'd have to remember what he said in the clip but maybe yeah maybe. Oh, okay yeah. so that's why i'm asking you because Confused. you Dids. do have controversial guests as we do and there's nothing wrong with talking to people who are controversial but Nick Fuentes is a very different kettle of fish, as we say here, right? Yeah, um, my, my opinion is that he was polite overall. I mean, he was a good guest. Polite? He's also denying the Holocaust. For, uh, well, 
Yeah. yeah. No. How is that polite? <laughs> Keep me honest. Says slavery was embellished and denying the Holocaust. I just think people are allowed to have their opinions. So if he is crazy. Yeah, they are. Crazy. They are. But and I think he, he should be you. allowed to talk about it on the podcast. But is it? Wow. Oh, she not sorry, man. Dude, y'all do some clowns, man. Any of y'all that's taken up for Anton or any of these guys, not good. Yeah, maybe we could do another show and we'll push back more. It's not that I know we But surely, that isn't that the reason. I wanted to do like one with Dr. Umar, but he didn't want to come. Um, why Why would he want to do a show? Dr. Are you? like the same opinions as men. She's literally nuts, man. She yeah. thought Dr. Like Umar was going to come. Yeah, there are some people who believe that, sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But... You know, when you were talking about the Holocaust with him, he was saying it's like slavery, it got embellished, and you were sort of going, mm, I, can, I can see your point. Mm -hmm. And that's why I found it a bit confusing, because mm -hmm. then in your apology, you said, well, I wasn't really educated on these things. I, yeah. Um, but it sounds again, like you're kind of taking that back. Again, um, okay, 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 hold on. I, got a, I can pause it. If she not educated on these things, then why does she have an opinion on reparation then? I'll tell you why she got an opinion on reparation. Because she's racist. That's why. When people is racist, that's an emotion. It's not based on fact. Because we all have the same color blood. Only difference with us is the things we like, things we dislike. Skin texture, tone, and hair texture. So, these people are going to make me late to where I got to go. We're going to do a part two to this. I got to get through here. Uh, we're going to do a part two. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching because there's a lot more to this. So we're going to do a part two.